In the sustainable use, planning and design of our environment, geological knowledge plays an essential role. 1 to 25,000 scale geological maps provide the data needed for natural hazard prevention, land use planning, construction engineering and location of groundwater and raw material at both surface and subsurface. Geothermal energy, deep geological repositories and carbon capture and storage are becoming increasingly important. At the Monterey Underground Rock Laboratory, experiments and tests ranging from the metric to the nanometric scale provide critical information about the hydrogeological, geochemical and geotechnical behaviour of Opalinus clay. The Swiss Geological Survey from Swiss Topo is the competence centre of the Swiss Confederation for all the geological matter. We are dealing with geological data, geological information, geological product and also geological research. The Swiss Geological Survey has worked for more than 80 years in collaboration with universities and other geologists on the development of the Geological Atlas of Switzerland. It consists of 220 high position geological maps and aims to cover the entire territory of Switzerland with state of the art geological maps and digital data sets at a scale of 1 to 25,000. New maps are still printed in house while digital vector data will be harmonised in the coming years in order to have nationwide seamless geological coverage of Switzerland. The production has moved very fast in the last years. We always start with a handwritten original, but in the last years we also moved to digital originals that are provided to Swiss Topo. And then the whole production in-house is done on geological information systems, so we have from the very beginning a vector data set that is used. Digital map production is based on high-resolution digital elevation models, aerial photographs and 3D visualization tools, which help to enhance the original field map. The datasets also contain information about instabilities, raw materials and groundwater conditions. The third dimension is represented in boreholes, profile sections and isopack maps of the bedrock. All these data provide useful information to ensure sustainable regional development and are important base data for managing the subsurface. The distribution of geological data is made via various channels and has evolved from the printed map to online data viewers and most recently onto mobile devices offering detailed geological information wherever you need it. The demands of our customers are an important incentive for us in developing new data sets as well as new ways of distributing them. Geological maps in combination with boreholes and seismic lines provide a deep insight in our underground and play an important role either in science but also in applied geology. Flying over the Swiss Fallen Basin into the Jura Fold and Thrust Belt, we head down into the northernmost Jura mountain chain, where, at the fracture network along the Highway Safety Gallery, the Monterey Rock Laboratory is found. The Monterey project is an international research project for the deep geological disposal of radioactive waste, but also of CO2 disposal, CO2 sequestration. Fifteen partners from Europe, the United States, Canada and Japan are involved in the research programme under the leadership of the Swiss Geological Survey. At Monterey we have three types of experiments. First we have classical research and development experiments. Then we have characterization experiments dealing with the rock properties. And finally, we have demonstration experiments where we want to show how the engineered barrier interact with the natural barriers of the claystone. The Swiss Geological Survey has developed a new technique for identifying small-scale water flow paths in geological formations. Small diameter boreholes are drilled and a fluorescein doped epoxy resin is injected into packed off borehole intervals. Resin injection pressures are controlled in order to prevent artificial fracks. After polymerization of the resin, overcalls are drilled, extracted, cut and analyzed macroscopically and microscopically under UV light.
the results we have obtained here at Mount Derry are quite important for all sorts of geological disposal and also for the CO2 sequestration. And Mount Derry is a pilot project. We have seen that many countries will apply this research on their own sites. Water flow paths detected under microscopes and in boreholes can also be tracked in the tunnel at a larger scale. This information will also be compiled with additional surface data to produce geological maps at the scale 1 to 25,000 or three-dimensional models. As a centre of competence at the federal level for the collection, interpretation and dissemination of geological information, the Swiss Geological Survey ensures a sustainable use, planning and design of our environment.